So we have a new update available for a CR Droid. CR Droid is one of the most popular, quite old, old custom rooms out there. And it's now based on the latest Android 15 already, which is having the beta version. But this one is a new update, which is actually based on Android 14. This is CR Droid version 10.10. .10. And I'm not exactly sure how many devices got this update yet, but if you did not, I guess you will get the new update very, very soon because this is Android 14. It's quite stable. And for the users who just don't want to experience Android 15 right now, can't try out this CR Droid latest version. Although with this new update, we do not have any major changes because the main focus is on Android 15. And as far as I know, with Android 14, we've, even with the upcoming updates, you might not see the major changes or features additions. You might only see the new security patch as this update brings you. This is having the November security patch. Uh, the thing is, it's good enough and especially if you want to use CR Droid because of any reason, but because Android 15 is not stable yet, even CR Droid latest Android 15 is in the beta stage, then you should try out Android 14 latest update, especially if you love CR Droid. Because this latest update, which is having the member security patch, it's good, it's stable, it's Android 14, so yes, what else do you need? This is CR Droid, and in case you don't know, this is one of those custom rooms which brings you good stability. I mean, this is one of the quite stable custom rooms out there the performance is quite good it brings you some of the things which we are trying to show you in this one as you can see some of the wallpapers which are pre-installed and already available from a long time actually one thing what i found here is in this one is in the more security and privacy options you will find the option named as app lock in case you don't know android 15 base here yeah, red also brings you a lot of customizations a lot of features already even in the beta stage but as far as i know the app locker is not there even the app locker is present, although the app lock is present in the default launcher settings, but not exactly available in the settings app. And of course, there are some limitations with Android 15 that you cannot use some third party launchers because it brings you some issues. It, it, it gives you some issues regarding private space. But other than else, yeah, Android, Android 14 could be a choice for you because it brings you all the customizations you need most of the customizations which yeah, Android always brings you similar thing to Android 15. There are minor differences right now available with Android 15 or Android 14. Not a major difference, but still in case you are right out, you can. As you can see, we have some status bar options, quick settings panel. I mean, I use these features. If I use CR Android, I enable these kind of these sort of options on my device. Although if you use CR Droid, even with Android 14 or Android 15 does not matter. Sometimes you need some address modules to make it complete. For example, the disable flag secure feature, unfortunately that's not present for that. I always use a module for that. And one more thing is, I'm not exactly sure what was that, but that was also another module was there. I guess that was related to IME space, the space below the keyboard. Unfortunately, that's, that's not available with CR Droid at all, even from a long time. So I use some modules for that. But CR Droid is quite good. I guess it's based on lineages. I'm not exactly sure, but it's good in the terms of stability, in the terms of performance. CR Droid is always quite smooth custom room. Notification section, as you can see, heads up notifications and even the island notifications, everything what you need is already present here, especially if you don't want to use Android 14, uh, sorry, if you don't want to use Android 15, Android 14 is actually the choice for you. We have some in-call vibration options. We have adaptive playback option also present with the CR Droid, even with Android 14, so that's good. And also, if you take a look at some miscellaneous options, things are quite similar in this case, like Netflix spoofing, unlimited photo storage, etc. And we have the custom three-finger swipe gestures available. Although, as far as I know, this three-finger custom three-finger swipe gesture option was actually removed from Evolution XOS customer because it was giving you some errors. But quite good that CR Droid is already bringing you this without having any issues and it's available from a long time now. Let me show you one more thing if you just notice there's a cloned apps feature which is present in this case. So if you want to use cloned apps feature, if you want, if you want to clone the apps on your device, you can do so. This option is present in this app info options, basically in the app settings. So these were things I just wanted to let you know if you want to try it out on a device, you can. Link is already there in the description for all the official supported devices. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Until then, make sure to like this video.